A New York judge today held former President Donald Trump in contempt of court, fining him $10,000 a day for failing to produce documents subpoenaed as part of that state's investigation into business practices at the Trump Organization. Trump is appealing. And speaking of the former president, it seems everyone has an opinion about Prince Harry and Duchess Meghan, including him. Former President Trump doesn't hold back when it comes to Meghan Markle. Harry is whipped. Do you know mm. the expression whipped? I'm familiar with the phrase. I won't use the full expression. <laughs> But Harry is whipped like no person I think I've ever seen. <laughs> I'm not a fan of Meghan. Yeah. I'm not a fan. And I wasn't right from the beginning. Sexy. I think poor Harry is being led around by his nose, okay? You think he's going to end? I do. I've been a very good predictor, as you know. I predicted almost <laughs> everything. It'll end, and it'll end bad. The bad blood between Trump and Meghan goes way back and came to a head in 2019 during Trump's state dinner with the Queen. Meghan and Harry did not attend. Was it a snub, as Trump claims? Meghan had just given birth to Archie and was on maternity leave. Trump tells Piers Morgan's new TV show, Uncensored, that he believes Meghan and Harry should have been stripped of their royal titles when they moved to California. The only thing I disagree with the Queen on, probably one of the only things ever, is that I think she should have said, if that's your choice, fine, but you no longer have titles, you no longer, and frankly, mm. don't come around. The Trump interview airs tonight on the premiere episode of Piers Morgan Uncensored. That'll be on Fox Nation.